hey guys so welcome back to the other interesting topic so today we are going to see uh, a 3d print a design uh, so which is going to be helpful for a, a, a flower pot or you know many uh, unique designs uh, maybe uh, for essentials we can use uh, so uh, yeah this I'm gonna do for a, a 3d uh, print for the flower pot but maybe can be used for varieties of you know a home decor I can say so without wasting much time let's start with a new part so control n let's the new part comes and then we're gonna start with a, a sketch and uh, various option in the uh, features uh, followed by solidworks yeah so let me start with the front plane so here it's, it's it's gonna be very simple like just a revolver and the other uh, features if you see uh, you know uh, in the uh, outer exterior of the uh, revolve we're going to make a, a little art piece and kind of a bend to make more complex when I mean, now you see the flat part so i'm gonna create a simple sketch i already have done so i might be knowing some dimensions which to be great yes So we will remove this link. Sorry, guys. Let me try with this. Let me one twenty five in the top, and total height could be one fifty, and uh, this should be one fifty. Okay, I am gonna select the arc. I'm gonna do this. Yes, yes, and I'm gonna select this with center line. So now the the skeleton I mean the outer part is ready. So I'm gonna do with the revolve with the help of center axis. I'm gonna select OK. So uh, this body outer part is ready. So now I'm gonna create. Moreover, I'm going to play with the exterior surface. So here I'm gonna select again on the front plane. I'm gonna select a uh, oh, sorry, I'm gonna select the intersection curve. So I just need this curve uh, for the outer body, and uh, I'm gonna create the profile and some arc and the uh, straight line. Yeah, this makes little, uh, but yeah, we have to give the dimensions. I'm gonna do some little offset from here to here somewhere around 22 and this could be in around 90 that's what I have planned yes so and also I'm gonna give some degree for this chain 4 and I'm gonna create somewhere around 35 degree yes and uh, we have enough dimensions to create Now I'm gonna create a revolve. By help of the center line. So I'm gonna select now the center axis. Yep, so I just looking for a two degree which I have created here at the center of uh, the plane and uh, gonna remove the major result. So I just want to uh, eliminate the bodies to be uh, get separated from the two uh, uh, bodies I'm gonna select now ok so now these two bodies are separate like uh, by help of this so what I'm gonna plan here is like I'm gonna go to do a twist or a flex so here you go with the option flex in such box oh, sorry oops. and uh, I'm gonna select these two bodies so that I will get a center axis if I only select these two, uh, so I may not get an exact center at this. So I, yeah, you can just go for a twist and make this two axis to zero. This to zero, and Y we have, but also here this to be zero, and uh, Y could be thirty. Its height at the center. I don't know what could be the 
if you maybe yeah, you can make 90 uh, sorry so, 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 zero and uh, this I just need to rotate so for that I need some point to select we can make a 370 degree yes looks good and so zero yeah perfect and uh, 30 mm is on height and now I'm going to make a twist of 90 degree yes now if you see this profile along with the revolve so the revolve doesn't look any twist since it's on completely a circle or kind of an act going to uh, act with the center point so I'm gonna select OK. Yes, perfect. So I'm gonna remove this. So now I'm gonna add a good quit or uh, uh, like uh, fillets. So I mean the soft to make soft corners for this both edges uh, by around like can say point eight. Yes, that looks good. Yes, perfect. So now we have an option for. Uh, a circular pattern so again I want to select the center I mean uh, circular or even an axis also you can select and number of uh, parts to be created like 50 uh, circular pattern has to be created so that I have some unique design in the outer body oh sorry I think I have to remove this and I have to go with the body option so it's not a future I have to select this body yes yes I'm gonna select OK. Perfect. Yeah, it looks cool. Now I'm gonna create a shell which is around 3 mm. I want this profile has to be created. So let it be this. Yeah, perfect. Shell has been created. This is how this profile looks. Yeah, perfect. Premium could be fine enough for this, but you can also do a scale uh, if you have this model, like how I have done the same way, uh, whichever size if you want and how thick you want, you can customize according to your need. Uh, so I'm gonna select now this and this create a a frame should be fine to make more little, you know, um, exterior. Uh, Part. so I just give a, a kind of a boss to give some grip on the, the top and the bottom as well yes so yeah I can just come by and uh, yes we can just do a extrude of high mm let it be solid uh, should it be for that body I forgot to specify it was for the selected body it's not for all the bodies but when it comes started loading <laughs> it will be considered as all the body so but still uh, we need uh, some process uh, to make more creative but uh, also can be done in this way if you if you are okay with this design like you can just stop up to this uh, future process and then uh, you can proceed for the 3d print but still we can enhance this design by adding more you know surface features into this so I'm gonna show you now, uh, but uh, it's taking a time process. Let's let's wait for a quick. I mean, around one minute. But let me let me pass for some time, so that I can come back again once this is done. Since I have forgot to specify the body, it was like progress, you know, processing for all the bodies now to get merged. Since it's all a multiple body, we have around fifty one bodies we have. So let me pass for a second and I'll come back once this is done so then I can remove and teach you I mean tell you the process again let me pass for some time okay yeah <coughs> coming back so I have uh, selected the selected body and I'm going to select this body as I said before and uh, I'm gonna select okay so now uh, we have a, got a quick response 
so this looks good yes yeah perfect and now what we are gonna do here is like uh, before we're going to serve, uh, do a <coughs> roll back to, to here and uh, yeah so I'm gonna create a little surface on the over, on, over top of this so I'm gonna select the uh, frame plane again I'm going to do a convert and DT uh, by selecting the edges of these pieces yes okay good also I forgot to add one more fillet on this river I'll go back so that it will be easy for me uh, I think fillet as you here we have a like, little sharp Ages, so I just want to avoid that. So I'm gonna create. Oh, sorry, well, five should be fine. Okay, it's already tangent, so no one required. Sorry, guys, <laughs> I forgot to <laughs> say that. Okay, fine, no, no, no issues. So I come back, yes, and this is a sketch we have here. And I'm gonna do a revolve again and I'm going to, this time I'm going to make a mid plane and I'm gonna select the axis yes and 25 should be fine 25 should be fine for this width this is a width but yeah again it's it's a width for us I'm select okay now so I will come back again to the end of this uh, feature tree and we will be going to start with a new uh, you know uh, process for the external but still if you if you want if you are fine with this design you can proceed but again you want to enhance more uh, then you can just go ahead with this body I am gonna select a thickness which I would like to have around a 2 mm outer face yes it should be outer be out of but yeah. yes but still like you know we can we can have uh, meat and also we can extend a little bit on that I don't want to merge now I'm gonna select I'm going to uh, now just add the thickness so now I'm going to move face to certain areas like no face Yes, yes, yes. Also here, around 5 m should be fine. Yes. Now we will enable the body. I mean, um, show this body. still we are in okay I think <coughs> only this we will add some more areas so 10 mm no, okay yes yes now this looks good actually again let me check that yeah yep <coughs> and think I have observed one mistake which I have done here is like this extrude I think uh, this has to be covered in the outer face so what uh, we will do quickly we will change the part I mean uh, change the uh, circle diameter but uh, to cover uh, the exterior face as well like you know let me let me quickly remove the edge so then I can extend up to some face here that makes sense yes perfect and uh, it should be a center of this area yeah I think this looks good I will extrude that up to it so then what happens is like when you yes this this is the reason I thought of doing that so that it will get merged properly 
with the body yes now it looks good yeah so uh, the objective is like again uh, we are going to make a twist for this uh, to make this time we are going to do a flexible at uh, the reverse if, if I do the same it won't good uh, looks good actually so I'm going to select the same and here it should be again a zero zero That's what okay. That looks okay. Zero and one ninety. Okay, fine. Not an issue. And I just want to move the T again for this also as well as as well as the T. And uh, let it be a uh, two seventy. Yes, that makes sense. And this time we'll make a uh, forty five degree. Okay, not forty five degree. Minus forty five degree. Yes. So not ninety. Again, not. I don't want too much twist. Let it be a small amount of twist should be. Yeah, I think 30 should be fine or like we'll go with again 25 mm. Yeah, maybe yeah 30 should be fine. We will we'll maintain the same height of that. And we'll do that. Okay, then we'll gonna select okay. Yes, perfect. Yeah, and now we are good. And <coughs> we'll try to do the circular pattern of the same body. Uh, so yeah, I will go with this edge and solid body of this but not 50 i will go with five should be fine yep fine makes sense or you can also increase like however you want okay so yes the extra bodies we will remove now so how, how are we going to remove that is like <coughs> we're gonna select the front plane and uh, quickly uh, we are going to do the convert or intersect curves intersection curves yes this makes sense and on side we are going to remove all the sketches and we will bring to the center sorry yeah maybe yeah, we have to do the origin yeah this is like this at the center and click yeah edit yeah good 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 this will make yeah at the point yes perfect perfect we'll do one swipe or a sweep cut yes yes single sweep cut for all the bodies whichever is applicable uh, which is come under that oh my god sorry there is an error I know there should be an error yes that's why that's why it's cut at the center I can also select multiple bodies so I just want to cut these bodies yes please go ahead Good. so now uh, we are done and also I forgot to one thing I can also add a fillet over here uh, <coughs> yeah after flex also we can do that so I just want to add some 3mm to match with this profile hey guys so just let me know in the comment section if you are feeling bored or you, you are looking for more interesting uh, topics to be covered please please let me know so that I can try to focus more on the requirement what you are looking for in my channel so yes So uh, that is done. Now I'm gonna do the wall cut as well. So hope, uh, yeah, almost we are done. So we are having a multiple body. So 56 now. So we are going to do a single command. Uh, I think uh, direct editing option. You might be knowing combine. And I'm going to add. Uh, I'm going to select Control A. Yes. So my all body is being selected, and I'm gonna select OK, and the body will become a single. So what we have seen in the thumb line, the same thing which we have created now. You can scale up scale down as per your requirement however you want so uh, basically uh, this is what I thought of uh, showing today's uh, session uh, will definitely uh, will do a lot more complex uh, 3d print models uh, in upcoming uh, videos so I think uh, you uh, like the method what I have used in here please you know go and comment uh, if you have time just let me know so we have more interaction uh, 
yeah that's what I'm, I'm looking forward uh, so that I can try my best to showcase some more complex model in future it takes time I guess because we have multiple bodies and my RAM is little uh, you know down so it takes time to get combined also sometimes I also will get some kind of an error uh, you know while doing combine since it's all a zero zero uh, phase you can download this model I'm gonna give the uh, my uh, crap CAD where you can check in my profile in YouTube about you can go and directly download whatever the model which I'm creating here you can get it from the grab card website it's completely free you can just download it from my profile so yeah i think it will else let me uh, pass and i'll come back soon so i don't want to waste your time hey a uh, guy so uh due to some reason it got crashed and but i have opened my previous uh, uh, model which i have done before so it's like the same process so how this combined has worked so yeah you can you can just have a look so the after combine uh, the profile looks like a single body so yeah I, I, I was waiting for more than half an hour and due to some technical reason or I don't know due to the geometry it got crashed again I have thought of showing the previous model which I already have done also I was consuming sometimes I don't know like due to the RAM yeah please just give a command in the below section like what could be the reason so why it is taking too much time for combining uh, for a small certain uh, amount of bodies and due to a network or band any any issues just I've done before but yeah I think you got it so yeah you can see this now with the operate I can also change the ambient uh, to the plane yes yeah so this is how it looks you can also do a 3d print so it will be more flexible and also being um, manufacturing feasibility also it's quite simple yeah so yeah that's all uh, for today's video and uh, i will definitely uh, come back with a more complex for the next video so until then uh, bye from uh, shape it see you guys take care bye bye